And our Minister of Finance and the Coordinating Minister of the Economy, Wali Edun, has blamed the current inflation in the country on eight years of printing money without matching it with productivity by former President Mamadou Buhari. The Finance Minister reiterated the resolve of the federal government to audit the 22.7 trillion ways and means advance under former President Buhari's regime. From the strategic reserves of grain or food, and another 62,000 tons or 60,000 tons of rice goods is made available just to tide us over that period. Because you have a good dry season harvest, you have a good wet season harvest, and that issue, because the inflation is still inflation. And I don't want to take our time going into the fact that it is going across the border and so forth. But what I would say is this by emphasizing <coughs> putting money in people's hands, giving people purchasing power. That maybe raises prices a bit, but it stops it going across the border because at a, at a little higher price, the farmers will sell locally. And in terms of putting purchasing power in people's hands at this critical time, apart from the direct payments, there's the nano uh, industries, the artisans, the water sellers, the sellers and, and repairers and so forth, they are all, there's 50 billion naira going to be given across that whole ecosystem, 774 local governments, at least 1,000 people will benefit from 50,000 naira. In his closing remarks, the chairman of the committee, Senator Sani Musa, said the interactive session will be a continuous exercise in knowing the short-term and long-term plans of the government on its way out of the precarious situation. People are giving surplus to add the same people that are employed. They go to their salary, they go to their houses, they go to their party anywhere they go. So uh, it's very important that the minister look at that. And then the envelope budget, which one of us spoke about, you know, you'll see so many line items. Was, it's continuous, it's just in the system. What from the budget office, they just roll it out and present it as a budget. There's a need for us to seriously, not only you on that side, but even us here, to look at this. And this is the reason why we need uh, to create the office for this budget office in Russia. So it's very important. Two weeks ago, the Senate resolved to probe the 30 trillion naira ways and means spent by the Buhari-led federal government, which, according to it, was recklessly spent.